In Contra County, more dead animals and mosquitoes have been testing positive for West Nile virus. Crown Forest Philippe Chagall shows us how crews are now responding to the surge in cases and what people living in these areas should know. Steve Schutz examines a group of mosquitoes collected from a trap in Concord. He focuses on identifying only two of 23 mosquito species found in Contra Costa County that can efficiently transmit Mostly West Nile virus. And Schutz says the virus spreads in the summer. Basically uh, June through about October. Schutz is the scientific programs manager for the Contra Costa Mosquito here. and Vector Control District. We have 23 locations where we set those traps every week. And the trap are spread throughout the county. West Nile virus is widespread in Contra Costa County. Nola Woods is a spokesperson for the Mosquito and Vector Control District. So far in Contra Costa County, we have had 10 birds, 10 dead birds test positive for West Nile virus. And they have come from all over Contra Costa County. In July and August, seven groups of trapped mosquitoes have also tested positive for the virus. Contra Costa Health Services says no humans have tested positive this year. The last person to test positive countywide was last year and they recovered. Since 2005, 75 people have been diagnosed with the virus and in 2006, two people died from the disease. Dump out any standing water and scrub those containers and to make sure that they're wearing repellent when they're going to be out at times where mosquitoes are present and check their windows and their door screens and make sure that they fit properly and they're in, in good shape so that they're not letting mosquitoes in the house. Diseased mosquitoes can infect humans and animals with a single bite. In Concord, right. Philippe Jagal, Cron 4 News.